your hub for accurate, timely, actionable information. Seasoned investor or novice, we've got you covered. Welcome to FundCode. Is Abin's Holdings Lutenid demonstrating a trend of financial strength, or does the third quarter of the financial year 2023 to 2024 tell a different story? Abin's Holdings Lutid, a revered name in the financial sector, recently unveiled its third quarter results for the fiscal year 2023 to 2024. The performance in this quarter has unrolled fascinating numbers, showing distinctive shifts from the corresponding period in the previous year. The company reported a revenue of a staggering 5.07 billion rupees. However, this figure is down by 11% from the third quarter of 2023. This drop in revenue is an area where Abin's Holdings Looted will need to focus its efforts for improvement. In contrast, the net income of the company has seen a growth spurt of 3.1%, amounting to a healthy 216.5 million rupees. This growth in net income is a positive sign of the company's financial resilience. The profit margin, another crucial financial indicator, has also shown an upward trend. It has climbed to 4.3%, a significant leap from 3.7% in the third quarter of 2023. This boost in margin was primarily an outcome of lower expenses, showing that Abin's Holdings Looted has been successful in optimizing its cost structure. Additionally, the earnings per share or EPS has also seen a positive shift. It has risen from 4.66 rupees in the third quarter of 2023 to 4.76 rupees in the third quarter of 2024. As for the stock performance, the shares of Abin's holdings have slipped by 1.3% from a week ago. This fluctuation suggests that the market has had a mixed reaction to the company's third quarter results. The board has declared an interim dividend of 3 rupees per equity share of face value of 5 rupees each, amounting to 182.79 crores for 2023 to 2024. In conclusion, the third quarter results of Abin's Holdings Lieutenant present a mixed bag. While the company has witnessed a dip in revenue, it has managed to increase its net income, profit margin, and EPS. This indicates that the company has successfully curtailed its expenses and ameliorated its profitability. Yet, the decline in revenue is a concern that potential investors should monitor. Remember, these results are just a snapshot of one quarter. A more comprehensive understanding of the company's financial health requires a longer-term performance review. Factors such as the balance sheet, cash flow and future growth prospects are also crucial when evaluating performance. Be mindful that this analysis is based on the data available and does not serve as financial advice. Always conduct your own research or consult with a financial advisor before making investment decisions. Before you go though, we've got some fantastic recommendations for you. If you're into stock market news and updates, you're going to love these picks.